Hello, Your Majesty, and welcome to Friday. Well, it's going to be an okay weekend. I know where the Leos are today. The moon's still in Virgo, just coming off of Saturn. There's a good chance of the woe is me Leo syndrome. You know, where suddenly someone who's royal suddenly feels like they're picked on by the universe, and you just have to the worst life in the world, even though you're wearing cashmere while you're crying. You know what I'm talking about, Leo? You're not getting sympathy from me. This is the universe trying to encourage you to grow up about your expectations around self-esteem, around money, etc. It's true, you are royalty. But I got bad news for you. If you've incarnated as a Leo, you have incarnated with the past memory of being royalty, but most likely are not. Doesn't that suck? That means in this lifetime, even though you expect the finest things, you've got to work for it like the peasants. And that is the irony of Leo. But when you are done with that lifetime, you truly own the power because you have had the power, lost it, and gotten it again. That is the greatest American story, right? So emotionally today, you're probably in that bottom trap. That's what I'm guessing. The moon crossed over Saturn yesterday. Watch yesterday's show for the details of what that's about. But you're going to be just fine. You're really just learning the value of your own dollar, and this may be a hard reality day. Now, through the weekend, I think things do lighten up regardless. The moon moves into Libra. What's going to throw you into speculation, throw you into gossip mode. Leo's on the phone with all their other Leos and that sort of thing, talking and sharing stories and learning, and that will really be the theme of the weekend. And it's likely that the topic deals with marriages or being alone. I can easily see a Leo in a marriage kind of using the marriage as a way to look at the self-esteem issue. And I can easily see a Leo who's not in a marriage using the fact that they're single, throwing it back on the self-esteem issue. It's really about both. With the sun in the first chapter of Aquarius, you are identifying what you're incorrect about nowadays when it comes to marriage. Remember, you just upgraded to Leo 2.0, so you got to upgrade the idea of marriage too. And for the next few days, you're only going to see what's not good about it, and that's okay. That's what the universe wants you to do. Take notes and keep going. All right, Your Majesty, that's all I have. I'll see you back on Monday. Live, love, be.